Good afternoon, everyone. Not three news now. Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz. A hot and humid start to the work week this afternoon. Omaha climbing into the low 90s. But southeast Nebraska, some of you will get into the mid 90s. And then northeast of Omaha, not quite as hot, but still pretty rough. Temperatures topping out near 90 for you. But here in Omaha, with the humidity today, probably feeling closer to 105 by the end of the afternoon. Still hot out there tonight at 9 o'clock, cooling into the mid 80s. But the humidity still making it feel probably like the mid 90s at that point. Should stay dry overnight tonight, but can't completely rule out an isolated storm north of Omaha. And it looks like a warm start to our Tuesday with low and mid 70s. Tomorrow afternoon, the heat gets even worse. Omaha into the mid 90s, which means some upper 90s in southeast Nebraska. And for Omaha with the humidity, that could make us feel like 110. And we'll see similar heat and humidity on Wednesday. Now, late Tuesday and late Wednesday, both could bring a couple isolated storms to dodge. Now, the severe weather the threat is pretty low, but the couple storms we do see could have some hail, strong wind, but most of us keep it dry late both days. Also, we're hoping for mostly clear skies out there overnight tonight. Potential for the northern lights to be visible in parts of our area. See that green line near Omaha? That's as far south as you could possibly see those with the naked eye. Better chance, though, if you put your camera or phone on a longer exposure and look to the north. But again, you will need to get away from those city lights. It looks like the storm will be peaking kind of overnight into early Tuesday morning before sunrise. So that's going to be your best chance to see those for our area. So today, though, hot and humid 93, tomorrow 96, and Wednesday up to 97. Then Thursday and Friday, a little bit of relief down into the low 90s. The humidity will also fall a little bit into the weekend, and that will let our mornings eventually fall into the upper 60s. And then this weekend, low 90s with plenty of sunshine.